Howdy folks, how you doing? This is Heath, and this is Frontier Survival. Guys, today we're going to bring you a quick video to show off something that we, we showed off not too long ago, right on Dynamite Live, right here on the YouTube channel, and that is this right here. Boom! Boom fire starters. We got these at our local tractor supply, and uh, they say that they are fire starters for grills, fireplaces, and camping and you get eight units and if you can see where what they look like look like little little balls of dynamite or little bombs so uh what we're going to do guys we're going to do a demonstration we're going to get down and dirty we're going to light one of these with a big lighter first of all and see how long it might actually burn all right we'll be right back okay we are back with you and we got one out right here check that out what that looks like it's got its own little wick we're going to see how long these work. We're going to start, like I said, with a Bic lighter. Let's reach here in the good old trusty cargo pocket and get it out. Light that wick. There you have it. The wick is lit. Looks like so far so good. That thing's doing pretty good, don't you think? We're going to bring the camera down just a little bit. We're going to throw this on the ground and see how well that bad boy will last. Make sure we got that in frame good, I think so. Let's bring the tripod down just a little bit. If we can. So far, so good. I don't know, guys. The wick's burning, as you see right there. It's almost burned down. We're trying to make sure this thing works like uh, it's supposed to. First time trying them out right here. Live in a living color. Well, not live, but an edited video for you. To see how long something like this would work. As far as it being a, an extender. And uh, so far so good. The wick's burned down and the flame still going. It's getting bigger and bigger as you can tell. Uh, you know eventually we probably won't be able to hold on to this much longer. The thing is is I think you could probably use a ferro rod with these as well. Because I think they might break down and crumble up. But we'll set this down here. And we'll see. Do a little time lapse here guys. See how long that burns. So far, so good. Probably, I don't know, it's gone a minute or so. All right, guys, it's been probably four minutes already. The thing's still burning. And as you can see, if you look closely, I can still pick it up. We are not halfway through that bad boy. It's just right there on the top burning. So I think these would last quite a while, don't you? Still burning. Seems like a pretty decent fire starter if you ask me. And I cannot really remember what we paid for those bad boys. But uh, I don't think it was a whole lot. And with that being said, you know, like I said, Tractor Supply Company is where a person probably could get these. That's the only place I've seen them. But so far, so good. Looks pretty decent, don't you think? Got a decent flame there. The man had some wood processed. Had his kindling, you know. Had some uh, big wood for fuel. Things would be going strong. You see the cat? The cat just made a cameo. That was sly. We got the other cat running around here beside us too, which is good old Roy. Some of y'all know Roy has seen him in some shorts on YouTube, different things. Still going strong though, guys. Still going strong. Probably five minutes now. I thought there's plenty of time to already have a decent fire going. And right there, guys, we still are able to pick it up. Look at that. Look at that bad boy. That's a flame if you ask me. Woo! That's awesome. That's an awesome deal. Get that up close and personal. 
Get that up close and personal. Look there. Whoa, boy. Thing's still burning. Awesome. Awesome deal. All right, guys. We think we already know, without doing a time lapse or anything, that this bad boy will burn long enough to get a good fire going. Next up, we're going to come right back to you. We're going to get down here. We're going to strike a ferro rod and see how well they do. Okay, folks, we're back with you. There's Sly, as you see, the one that we lit with the Vic lighter still burning. Um, we got one more here. Like I said, probably what we're going to have to do is see if we can't pulverize this to make a dust of some sort to strike with a ferro rod. So here we go. We're going to grab it in our hands. We're going to see what we can do. Oh, yeah, that breaks up real nice. It breaks up real nice. We'll show you here. There you have it. Looks like dirt. <laughs> what do you think about that? Well, we're going to see what we do here. We're going to throw this down right in here. We want to clear out a little bit more of a spot here. So maybe we can see some better. The other one's still going strong, though. with me guys all right so this dust right here we've done pulverize that we're going to throw that down to a nice little pile we got our trusty ferro rod right here in our pocket and guys you all know how i roll we have this trusty bayite ferro rod that's a half inch in diameter probably four to five inches long tethered with the, this paracord braided up and uh, with a striker right there on the end. So let's get down here and see what we can do with this. All right, here we go. One, two, three. It's got a spark, but it ain't hitting. Might take a few strikes. We'll see here. I don't know if it's going to work or not. It's burning a little bit. It might not work very good with a fell rod. Well, I might wear my ferro rod out trying to do this. As you see, the one we lit with the big lighter is still going strong. Guys, there's Ruger barking. <laughs> see, that's what, it is. that's what this channel is all about, guys. We try to make it real. If we got the dogs barking, we got the cats coming in and out of the shot, uh, we just introduce them and, and roll on. You know what I mean? We're going to try this one more time here see what we can do. It's caught some sparks, but it's not wanting to burn. Well, guys, I don't know. Don't seem like it's going to work with the ferro rod. Might be an epic fail with the ferro rod. I don't know. Maybe it's just a good light, a good big lighter fire starter. I'm not going to sit here and bore you to death trying to get this thing lighted. You know what I mean? Lit. So uh, we're going to chalk it up as an epic fail with the ferro rod. We all know a ferro rod is good to use as a combustion device. Anybody that's in the bushcraft, field camp craft, camp craft, whatever it might be, knows that a good ferro rod is always needed, if possible. Big lighters are good to have as well. And always wrap you some Gorilla Tape or duct tape on that big lighter. They make good fire extenders as well. All right, guys. With that being said, we're going to raise the camera up here. All right. Guys. As you see, the one we lit with the big liner is going strong. Still going strong. Still going strong. But it seems like the ferro rod might have been an epic fail. Maybe we need to practice it more often and try to try to get things going with there.
I don't know, it just wouldn't take a spark, even with it pulverized. But like I said, guys, we want to throw a quick video your way showing off these fire starters. And they're called Boom Fire Starters. Remember that. Find them at Tractor Supply. And, uh, of course, I'm not sponsored by them or anything like that. We never mentioned that earlier, but I'm not. I bought them with my own money just to try out, just to have content here on YouTube. Oh, guys, it's, it's been, a, been a hard summer this year. We've had different things happen, life events, um, offline life, but uh, we're going to try to get going real good here as uh, autumn approaches and more, video, more videos, more great videos coming your way like this one and uh, some adventures out in the wilderness as well. We'll have some prepping type videos, some, some stuff about self-reliance. We'll, uh, we'll even throw out uh, some gardening tips sometime soon. Uh, talk about the garden that we raised this year and uh, Miss Mandy, she's already done some canning. If y'all have seen any of the pics we posted on other platforms. But we post the pics right here on the community section as well, right here on YouTube. Guys, with that being said, we appreciate you. We thank you. We want you to like, subscribe if you will. If you haven't already, like this video, comment if you will. Let me know what you think about this fire starter. And with that being said, you know what you got to do. You got to have drive to survive.